Hey everyone, welcome to the fourth episode of Cooking with Blaze. I'm your host, Blaze. I know it's been six months since the last episode, but that's because I ran out of ideas, so if you were to comment me a suggestion on what to make, I'd be really happy, I'd appreciate that. On today's menu, teriyaki salmon. Now, you could count this as an early Koyoki birthday special, happy birthday Koyo by the way, but really I just really wanted to have salmon today. Or maybe I should check the day today. Disclaimer, I did miscalculate the proportions of some ingredients, giving me an extra bowl of sauce. But if you're as overly saucy as me, then you're good to go. Oh yeah, this recipe is technically non-alcoholic. Sorry, upside down cat. You're going to need a piece of salmon, obviously. Around a quarter cup of soy sauce. If you're wondering why I have a Gatorade bottle worth of the stuff, just look at my skin color. Something sweet, I'm gonna go with maple syrup, also coming from my multi-ethnicity. Some water, which I forgot to record since I'm not the avatar. Lemon juice to balance out the flavors. Now you could replace the water and lemon for sake, or since you probably don't have that around, some vodka or some white wine that you stole from your brother-in-law's stash. But I'd rather keep my liver right for the picking when the time comes, and that I'm not of age, and I don't want someone reporting on me. Some aromatics that you've hopefully chopped up earlier. A few cloves of garlic and an inch of ginger. And also some green onions that I forgot to put. And last but n n not least, <laughs> cornstarch, my worst enemy. <sighs> get over it, Blaze, that's all in the past. You got this. Phew. Now let's get started. First of all, get a saucepan with some oil on medium high and fry up your aromatics minus the green onion for about a minute. Then put your soy sauce, water, lemon juice, and sweetener in. And alcohol if you wish. Taste it if it's missing anything. Might need a bit more water and syrup. Now's a pretty good time right, to preheat your oven to around 375 Fahrenheit or 190C and oil up your aluminum line and baking dish. And then after that, get to get a bowl and then make some cocoa starch and mix it with some water. Lower the heat before slowly pouring the soy in. Keep mixing it until it thickens. Once thick, Turn down the heat and wait for it to cool off before spreading it evenly on your piece of salmon skin side down. Throw it into your oven for about 50 to 20 minutes, depending on how you like the salmon. I personally like to flip and blow mine at the end to get crispy skin. Afterwards, put it on your plate. I like mine though with some rice and broccoli, but you can have yours with water if you like. And there you have it, an easy dinner that will make you proud of yourself. This can easily be double or triple whether you have a date or guest over. Well done with this! Thanks for watching, hope you guys enjoyed, leave a like and tell me what to make next. That's all everyone, happy birthday to Koyo again and I'll see you next time.